hello guys how are you doing today welcome back to your show from our up tv thank you for joining us once again and thank you for being part of our program always um we're continuing our um series um planting in small spaces and um i just wanted to give us a little bit of update on um, some of our plants today uh that's the first set that we planted and also today we are going to be um starting up some new seedlings and um, we have some different stuff that we're going to use and um, we will be able to um, to to start this with you see how this comes comes out because um, as a small space farmer or gardener you would want to um, start up your own seeds as well so basically uh, we're going to be doing a little bit of experiment on starting this up as well you understand so i'm also going to be showing you um, um some of the other plants the shrubs that we planted in our first and second series and uh, to see how they are doing um we do have um some good news about that some are doing great and uh, maybe one or two um is not doing as uh, great as we expected but um we are still watching them seeing if um they're going to um revive um um they, they're going to be coming back up so thank you once again for joining us if you do like what we're doing um do like us subscribe and share um to your family click on the notification button so that um, we are able to share um what we do with um your families and friends thank you for joining us once again welcome to pharma of tv all right so thank you once again for being part of um, the show here are some of the shrubs that we planted um, previously you can see how well they're doing um, this is actually coming out real well um, really green big and um, you can see flowering already and um, also here's another one I believe this is um, our uh, uh that's um the candy pepper you can see the leaves coming out it's flowering already and um that's um some of the peppers coming out and also this one um it's one of the peppers as well um we have um our um what's this one the sweet um basil here um we are planning on to actually put um something on there that could help with um it um standing because it seems to be falling a little bit um also our rosemary is doing pretty well as well you know so that's um for that and um also over here we have um our you know this place is lovely um we have our salary street sticks they're really coming out doing very well and um also over there as well um we have this one which is um our uh that's um the pepper that's the early jalapeno that's um the they i'm sorry the jalapeno they are coming out uh, very good as well so our seeds um our, our shrubs are um, are really coming out nice um we our basic regiment um or a basic um, thing we do um every day is um just to you know make sure we, we water them very well we do have some nutrients that we add to our watering system as well and um, they seem to be coming out pretty nice as well and over here we have our basil as well which is um, doing pretty well so this is about um, the only one that it's not really coming out they seem to be dry um, what is this one I believe that's um, our time the time now isn't doesn't seem to be doing pretty well i think probably um you know there was a time it was pretty sunny the sun has really been um hot um, recently it's really really been hot in canada especially in vancouver where we are and um it's um you know one each wave after the other so you know some of our plants plants are really doing pretty well and some are not but um majority of them are pretty fine so um that's what we have so far and um, like i said we are going to be starting our our um seedlings from scratch as well we have some stuff that i'm going to be showing us that um, i'm going to be using different um things that i bought 
just to let encourage us to start um, gardening in, and planting in small spaces as well. That's the whole idea of the show. You understand? So get out, do something little, no matter how small your space is. There's even um, some um, stuff you could use that you could actually plant right in your own living room your room and things like that it would help you no matter what what no matter what happens so do you know you know you have no excuse not to do this because um it's going to help you a long way thank you once again for joining us if you do like what we do do subscribe um give us a thumbs up um, thum thumbs up on the show and um do like our show and um share with your family and friends thank you once again and um We'll be back um, to show you what we have for, for um, um, starting up our seeds. Thank you for joining us once again. If you do like what we, we're doing, do um, subscribe, um, like and share. Click on the notification button and do um, also um, share with your family and friends so that they are able to join us once again. Um, like I said, we are going to be doing some seedling start up right now and we do have some various way that we plan on doing this um some we're going to be using some of um this um um some guard um, some uh, starter kits and some we're going to be using um um what we call the fiber cubes and um you know we're also going to be using um sort of like um, a clay like cube as well we have um, different stuff that we're going to use. I'm going to be showing them to you right now. And um, we, like I said, it's um, a way to show us different things that um, we can use. Some uh, you know, are a little bit um, expensive and some are pretty cheap. So it depends on what you want to do and how you want to go about it. And do remember that I mentioned that um, we have um, kits that um, you could have in your living room, like um, hydroponic um, um, kits where you can have in your room in your living room in your house and um your plants will do very well with them um you know about it's all about the soilless um planting right now and um, that's a very nice way to go about it we are going to be doing something of that nature as well um we're going to be doing in a in a toad um what some people would call um, a container um, a box container we are going to be doing an hydroponic system, a small one, where we're going to be planting different um, seedlings as well. Uh, just to show you how, you know, you can plant, achieve planting in small spaces. So thank you once again for being part of the show. And um, hopefully very soon we are going to be having a new guest on our show to talk to you about um, agriculture in general, farming and importance and um, advantages of um, starting up um, farming as well. Um, here are some of the stuff that we're going to be using. Thank you. All right, so here are some of the stuff that um, we bought from our gardening, our local gardening store, and we are going to be using them um, to start up our seedlings. Um, the first, the very first one is um, it's from um, Terry Fiber. It's a natural fiber growing cube. Um, we are going to be planting our seeds in here, and um, all this is going to be helping us start up our seed as fast as possible. Um, we also have um, one from Easy Plug. Uh, it's a plug-in and grow system. Um, you can see that as well. We are going to be using this to start up. Um, we just want to see different um, methods on how we can start up our seedling. Um, another one which is also like um, the plug-in and go, it's um, from Speedy Roots. Um, it's from um, Jiffy as well. And um, we are going to be using this as well to start up our seedlings, you know. So we're going to try different um, method to see how we can have our seedlings started. And one of the things that we're going to be using, and uh, we're probably going to be starting with this, it's um, a kit called um, the Jiffy Hydro Kit Starter for seedlings and young plants. Um, we are going to be starting with this first today and uh, we're going to move to the other stuff on our next um, episodes so thank you once again for joining us we are going to be doing a sort of like um a revealing of what we have inside um you can see here where it says um jiffy hydro starter kit for seedlings and young plants um so basically it's a self-watering 
It's um, self-watering and lasts up to five days. Um, reusable four pot design, extra large system for better root development. So, you know, we gonna start with this today we are gonna plant in here we're gonna put um, a little bit of water and nutrient in there and um, we're gonna see how our our plants um, would would go so it's um from a start to you know finish where we're gonna be getting this done so inside um, that I'm gonna be opening it up now and I'm gonna be showing us and um, so that we can see what um, it's inside thank you for being part of the show always um, like I said, um, do try your best to plant um, as much as possible in small space. Um, it's very important, um, you know, it would help you reduce um, your, um, your spending in, um, in the grocery stores. And also you would know exactly what you're eating. You know how good what you're eating is, um, is um, gets um, good, it's better for your health. Um, unlike, you know, things you bought, at, you, you get at the grocery stores uh, that you don't know how it's been planted, what is used, um, you know. But if you do it yourself, you start it up in a small space. It's very important because you would be able to know what you use and what you didn't use. So that's a very good way to go about it. So join me as we open up this um, Jiffy Agro kit starter and um, we'll see what's inside. Thank you for joining us. Again, so this is what we're going to be um, starting up our seedlings with. Um, we're going to be opening up the box right now and um, show you what's inside. Um, all right. So that's um, the box, um, it's, you know, that's all we got inside. Um, we have your, um, this is where we can plant the seeds in there. And um, we have four of them. So our seeds can be planted in there. Um, you can see um, four different um, ones. Um, we have a cover that would hold the seed as well so that would hold the seed and um, we also like um, a manual that tells us um, what to do and everything and what's inside so basically that's all we're going to be doing um, okay so basically that's how we're going to be starting this for now uh, okay always try to read your manual so that you have an idea of what to do um, we need to fill this up with water mm. all right and um, we're going to be getting um, some seeds that we're going to start up with we're going to see how they're doing um, on here so do, 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 do. okay put that back put that in there mm. Okay. So I have some water here. I'm going to be soaking that up now. Um, I believe this water has some nutrients in them. So we're going to be using this for now. And um, I'm going to start up with that. And uh, we do have some nutrients that we bought actually that... Um, we're going to be using for this as well. So um, we're going to put in that in there. So that's our water going in. Our water. And I'm going to be placing um, our planting right there. Uh, yeah. So we're going to be getting our seeds now and um, we're going to put um, our seeds in here um, to start. Um, this is going to soak up and um, it's going to, our seeds is going to get water and from there it's going to start um, 
plant, um, growing as much as um, it's meant to go. So thank you for being part of the show once again. And um, if you do like what we're doing, like I said, do um, like and share and subscribe on the show. And um, we'll be very grateful for you to be part of um, the family. Thank you. Joining us once again. Welcome back to your show from our TV. So basically, um, from the um, the GF Hydro um, kit, we are going to be planting our seeds into um, our watering system. Um, remember, this watering system is a self-watering um, system. All you have to do is when it dries out, add more water to it. Um, some of the plants, um, the seeds that we're going to be planting is our parsley, um, the forest grain. We're going to be doing um, spinach as well. We're going to be adding our tomatoes and also our dwarf um, gray sugar pea. Um, so we're going to add about um, four seeds each in, um, in um, each one so that um, we're able to see how they grow and how they come out um, as much as um, possible. You understand? So just give me a minute. Just open this up. Remember, planting in small um, space, um, it's not um, something that um, it's so difficult to do. So all you have to do is, uh, like I showed you now, there are different um, um, ways that you could um, start this up. Uh, you understand? So um, here's our seed. And I'm going to be adding about um, four of that in there. Uh, so, uh, okay, I'm gonna add in that there. Um, we're gonna be doing the spinach as well. Um, and nice if um, I could open that, but I'm just gonna we're gonna be doing our spinach as well. Um, just to add about um, four as well in the next um, row in there so I'm oh, gonna be adding that in there so our next one is going to be um, the parsley and um, we're gonna be adding that um, as well in our next um, um, Some of the seeds are pretty tiny, so what I'm doing right now is that I, I would um, the I would um, cover them a little bit, just so that um, you know they don't dry out. And um, our next one is going to be the the um, peas, which we're going to add now. Just going to add a few of that as well in there. Remember, this is um, our watering system, so it's um, with um, water. The water is um, self-absorbed, and um, the water also um, it, we, all we have to do is just replace the water as much as we can. So um, that's all we need to do, and um, we we don't need to do much we're going to keep our um, our seeds um, in a safe space for um, um more for the other stuff that we're going to be planting so that's all we need to do today um we've been able to um, plant um four different um seeds in our jiffy hydro kits right now um it's a self-watering system um pretty small you know for a small space you don't need to have um, a big space for this and um, you know you can start with this you can have it indoors you can have it outdoors and um, it's um, going to work e either way all you have to do is just um, replace the water as much as you can 
Thank you for being part of the show always. And um, we hope we are able to encourage you to, to start up small space planting in, um, in a small space as much as you can. Thank you. All right. Thank you so much once again for joining us. So that's our episode today for um, the series planting in small space. Um, we've been able to show you um, um, a way to start up our seedling. In the continuation, we are going to be using some other stuff to plant to show you what we can do so that um, you, you would understand, um, you know, different ways that you can start up your seedlings, which is going to be of help to us. And um, if you do like what we're doing, do um, like and subscribe to our channel, share with your family and friends, and do click on the notification button so that um, we are able to share with um, everybody on there and we are able to let you know when and um, we're coming up with new episode and new series on, on, on our show. And um, we should be expecting to interview a new guest very soon and um, we'll update you on our social media platform of who that's going to be and um, what they're going to be talking about. Um, once again, no farmer, no food. Do um, plant in small space so that um, you're able to feed your nation and your family. Thank you. Once again, it's me, Ayo, signing out from Farmer Up TV. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye. Cheers.